here with Hans Steindl, Major of Burghausen. Hans, could you tell us uh, something about Burghausen, about the relationship with the Bridge Federation, the German Bridge Federation and the ABL? Uh, Burghausen is a, a very small city. We have only uh, 18,000 people here. But uh, it's a lovely city with a, a great uh, tradition in history and culture. We have the longest castle of the world. Yeah? It's looking down here to the marketplace for the players here. And uh, we have a, a, a big industrial compound in Burghausen. So we have uh, international uh, corporations here. And um, it's a vibrant city. Yeah? Uh, with an old town and, and, and an uh, innovative and new industrial uh, uh, compound. Uh, so uh, we are very happy having young players here, three, four hundred. Yeah? They are uh, uh, walking around here on the marketplace and it's a, it's a very uh, fresh and vibrant scenery and I love it. Yeah? And how do you support the bridge, the other sports, and also I know that Burghausen is famous for the Jazz Festival. Yeah, we are very famous for the Jazz Festival, always in, in March, every year. Uh, since uh, we, have, we have been um, performed it since uh, 40 years. Uh, and um, uh, bridge is a, a, new, a new event, but we have a, a fantastic organization here with uh, our Burghauser Bridge Club. My son played in the, in the, in the team, yeah? and uh, I was very surprised about his um, emotion, about his motivation to play bridge, because in, in, in Bavaria we have not uh, a traditional access to, to bridge. We have uh, Warten and Schafkopf, but not bridge. Yeah? And so, uh, I, um, I, I was uh, astonished about his uh, engagement and Mr. Hajani uh, uh, tried to, to motivate him to play, to play further on. Eh? <laughs> Eve, uh, what about uh, the, the manager of this championship? Uh, do you, are you satisfied when the last day of the championship? Yes. We are very satisfied, first in terms of participation, with a record of participants to these championships. The second thing is a great welcome of uh, the city of Burghausen and all the authorities here. We are in a very uh, lovely city and uh, we see uh, players enjoy to be there because, you know, they are all together. They are in a historical part of the city. Outside, they can find everything they want. They have uh, some uh, coffees, they have uh, some historical things to, to, to visit. And uh, also for the hotel and the accommodation, they are all together. And they like to be uh, like that in the juniors. It's a great family, yeah? Yeah, it's a great family. <laughs> and tomorrow we start the campus. There are some social events for the, all the players? Yes, uh, you know that uh, you renew with the camp. It was uh, last camp was in 2006. And uh, now we have a new camp. And we have uh, more than 120 uh, uh, young uh, registered and it starts tomorrow. The camp it is uh, not a competition. The, the camp it is uh, the opportunity to meet all together, to play bridge a lot because you know that they will play bridge in the morning, in the evening, all the night probably also, but also to have cultural and sport activities and uh, some lesson. But uh, the most important for them it is fun, it is to be together, it is to participate in an event with uh, all players uh, sharing the same values, the same sport, bridge, and the like that, to have a good spirit of that. Joseph, what do you organize for the people here for social events? For social events, uh, we made for them a beautiful organ concert. We have a very, very good uh, organist in the city and also instrument in very high value and excellent. We made also programs uh, like discos in uh, Friedside Heim and we shall make a treasure hunt around the river. The players can go over to Austria and come back to Germany and different stages got different questions. And generally we do, did want to make the best service for all participants and uh, officials to achieve this city, this beautiful city. It is a bit apart from Munich, apart from other big cities, but I think it is worth as a value to come to here. And I hope it that uh, these young guys with their families and with friends will come back not only as bridge players, but also if to or jazz festivals or any others uh, to find here some hours.